It seems that spring has sprung a leak at Minneapolis High School. Yeah, Patrick Henry High School was built back in 1926. It's almost 100 years old. Well, now teachers are concerned about the structural integrity of that building. Fox 9's Mary McGuire spoke with some of them. Mary? Well, the recent heavy rain and snowfall that we saw this week is causing widespread water issues at schools here in the Minneapolis School District, and that includes Patrick Henry High School over in North Minneapolis. The teachers that I spoke with there today say that the environment happening in the school is just not safe for staff or students. This room had to be evacuated. Leaking ceilings, wet floors, and crumbling tiles. The ceiling tiles are still sitting on the floor and on the tables. Those are just some of the water-related issues teachers and students say they have been forced to deal with this week at Patrick Henry High School in North Minneapolis, soon to be renamed Camden High School. We deserve a safe place to work, but not to mention so do our students. Literacy coach and teacher Sarah Splice says the problem started on Tuesday morning after spring storms. Some classes were moved, but others had the leaking portions sectioned off, leaving classes to learn next to the dripping water. She says a fix could have been simply switching to e-learning. The district specifically has it outlined in our contract for teachers that, that they promise to keep our building safe for us and our students to work in. That's not what happened. Splice adds some of the water was even leaking into the cafeteria. It all leaves her deeply concerned about what could happen in the future to the roof of the nearly 100 year old building. I don't know uh, how much more it can withstand those types of snows. What happens when it collapses on our kids? For its part, the district says their engineers have been at the school all week, assessing the damage, cleaning and making repairs, as well as conducting air quality testing. They add that the school is scheduled to get a new roof this summer. It's absolutely horrendous, and they're say insulting that we're still working in these conditions. Still, these teachers say they aren't confident the root of the problem will be addressed anytime soon. One of the classrooms that was affected is a classroom that I taught in two years ago. There were leaks in that classroom two years ago. Now, the district also tells us that they, until that roof is replaced, they will be monitoring the situation at Patrick Henry during severe weather, and they will be following emergency response protocols if safety is in jeopardy. Reporting live tonight, Mary McGuire, Fox 9. All right, Mary. A